All right, so here we've got the nozzles. One thing I learned is always have the jet in because once you put the jet in, it changes the height and that allows you to measure it correctly. So first thing I'll do is I'll put the uh, flared end, that's a flared end right there, with the sleeve and the nut, put that fitting on. Now I've got to make this thing go into this hole here, the second hole on the distribution block, if you can see it right there. So to line it up, I just take an extra tube and run that through into the hole. Now I can see kind of what I need. So looking around on this side, this needs to come up and over into here. So that's one bend. And then here, the second bed needs to go in a different plane into the block. So one bend and then second bend that way. All these bends are tricky because they have to have a certain radius on them. And based on where the nut is, if you look at the bender, the nut doesn't allow you to get the bend started really far. So because of the space this takes up, the bend has to start here. So I did one bend already. This is the second bend. And you can see how many degrees that is. Now we're gonna pop this thing out. And that's what we have. So two bends and they're in different orientations. One comes over this way and then the second bend goes this way. And there's actually a third bend here because You'll see when I place this in there, how it's supposed to fit. All right, so here's the fitting. First thing I'm gonna do is push it into the distribution block. And try to get that in where it's supposed to be. So you can see the first bend here, dips down, it just clears this, and then the second bend comes up and onto the fitting, when I rotate it, this should fit the flare perfectly over the jet like that. So 37 degree flare onto the jet, sleeve, nut, tighten. And that's the way this tube had to be run. So as you can see, it ends up being pretty complicated to get all these bends correct and you do go through quite a bit of um, stainless tubing. So these are some mock bins that I did just to make sure I could figure out how to run this panel right here.